when you That's came cool. to the final, right, the tough thing about the final, I always think this is actually the thing about sports and esports that's so rough, is fans never think this way. I notice fans are really good the second a match ends, just accepting, like, that's all that was ever going to happen. That was always going to be that result. It could never be. They just think like that. They think it's like a movie, dude. And, you know, like, what the play- person yeah. did meant that had to happen. What they don't realize, obviously, is, like, probability exists. Like, you know, if you wake up a different day, it's a different game. If game one goes differently, there's, you know, there's so oh, many fans. So the I question, I have is this obviously you've never been back to a world's final because it's really rare people make world's yeah. finals you must think back on that one and think of some of the things you could have done differently or what no, you should have uh, done to win right sure. like if we let's say we made it to semi-finals 2019 and we made it to finals 2020 I can guarantee you 100% we would beat that, that final so I can say confidently I think I would ever beat uh, Damon like that Damon 2020 I think we would never beat we were sure we can and them. We could play against them 10 times. We'll probably lose like 9 out of 10, maybe 10 out of 10. Uh, against IG, we'll probably lose like 7 out of 10, you know. But against FPX, just, you know, throw us back in the time. Give it time machine. Give us different uh, prep for that for that final. Give, give us different prep, different thoughts. And I can tell you, we can beat FPX like, I would say, 6 out of 10 times. Like, I'm sure, I'm sure that final is all about prep and all about our mental. Like, our mental was... So done. Instead of like doing some team activities and bonding, we were actually screaming academy teams for the final week. Like that was the most useless thing ever. Like it, that was like really useless, honestly. Like we didn't get anything useful. We were just tilting each other as well. Um, we were super scared of the Nautilus mid. We didn't have trust in our own picks. Like we we were just scared of what. Like we we just got so much inside the bubble of our own. The way we operate the whole year was like, oh, let's think what enemy does and let's try to counter them. And that's how we played the whole year. That's that's how we functioned the whole year. So there was just somebody, like let's say, um, like I I take time machine and I go back to that room in 2019 and I enter the room and I tell I tell the team, look guys, don't overthink things. Just go to your games of legends the GG and check what you played the most this tournament and play that. Just like, go with comfort simple. basically. Yeah, exactly. Just play comfort. Exactly. We play com- like we didn't play comfort. We went into like the like, weirdest we drafts tried ever. To be, like <laughs> we tried to be like 500 IQ. Yes. We went into like the whole like we tried to like outmind them and we just outplayed ourselves completely. Like we had like okay, we had like first time Chisana mid, first time Pac mid, first time Vega mid. Sounds like, like I'm flaming cups here only, but that, those do sound like, like troll picks like for world's finals. Yeah, it's it's also it's also like I was scared of playing. Kaisa because they play like Varus Tamkench against somebody else and they like right. really smurf the game. And then I was like, but I was like 4 0 with Kaisa. I was 6 0 with Zai, you know. Just I should be, I should be saying, just pick me Kaisa. I don't care if they go Varus Tamkench. I will go 20 assists down. I will still be useful. But instead, I was playing some useless shit. And my mid was playing Pike. And I don't know, we were puffing bot when we should puff top. Like all these things. Like we were just getting like so in our own bubble that like we just completely exploded. But like I don't know if we just all went to like one day of spa somewhere for the whole day. Like no no cap by the way. If we just went to we were in Paris, we could go to Disneyland. We could go to Disneyland for one day. I'm not joking. We would win the world finals. Just put me there on stage again. Give me give me time machine. We would win the world finals. I'm pretty sure. Like I don't think we were bad. I was I don't think we were worse than an FPX. I, I don't think so. And if you look how the game one won went and how we dead draft. We almost won that game, that game one that was like 45 minute game. Then you can't go and tell me, oh, no, no, FTX was way better than you. No, no, I, sure, maybe there's going to be friends who are going to come and flame me, yeah, but sure. I mean, I don't, I don't give a shit, right? Like, it's like, I'm just saying my opinion. Like, I think you put us out there again, uh, give us one guy who is outside of a team bubble, like somebody who is even a player from a different team. You can come to our room, check our jobs, and ask us, guys. What in the world are you guys doing? <laughs> you know, like, <laughs> what are you guys even talking about? You know, Wonder Red Cups are playing 1v1, Nautilus versus Olaf in mid lane, like, two days before World Finals. Like, do you know what, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like what is this, you know? I know. Like, just, like, step out of your bubble, guys. Let's, like, all, you know, <laughs> let's not overtick things. But, yeah, that's ba- that was a lear- learning curve. I can't say we'll be down one. I don't think we would. I think they were better than us. Probably lose them all the time, but it's fine.
Because you get the angle I'm saying there. The problem is, like, this is, again, where people who are young or people who are just casual fans won't understand, like, the competitor's mindset. Like, I've heard stories in sports where similar things happen. Like, you know, someone was in, like, the NBA finals. And when they lose, they're like, oh, it's okay, I'll get them next time. But maybe you never make the finals again. Maybe that's just the way your career goes. Like, it's got to be brutal to think, like, there's actually a world where I could have been the world champion in League of Legends. That's just insane to even think about. It's true, yeah. It actually is true. I mean, I didn't think about it too much, but I'm actually glad I got to vent about it because I feel like this has been in my system for <laughs> right. so long. Okay. Like, this has been in my system for so long, and uh, I'm glad I got to vent about it. Now yeah. it's on the internet. Now I let there it out. Go. Like, okay. here you go, guys. Feast on my pain, you know? <laughs> go. <There> you go. <laughs> right? See more cool, funny, interesting clips based on topics from my content? Well, subscribe to this channel then, or, you know, be a pleb and don't.